Good morning from the farm. Pleasure to be back. Thanks for joining us. That's pretty cool. Uh, we're here in the barn with the cows and everything else that's, you know, here. Hey, Mum. Good morning, Ru. How are you? I'm good, thanks. On this yeah. murky, foggy, mild morning. It's going to be one of those days, isn't it, when we're going to be whipping the layers off. The coat's nearly off already. Yeah. I had, uh, well, I go for sort of like four or five layers at the moment. Last <laughs> week wasn't enough. This week, I think we're, I'm doing yeah, okay. I'm a today. cold person, though. I know you know. are. My you brothers, really are. they wear shorts in, uh, in snow. Yeah. Um, I tend to opt for the more traditional trouser There's approach. Not a bit of fat on your body, is there? You need to eat more fat. Well, I'm trying. <laughs> 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 the diet's going well, actually, by Good. the way. We're quite awesome. enjoying it. Yeah. Awesome. Had really nice lamb chops on the oh, weekend. Oh, they're delicious, aren't they? Yeah. That's Dad's ultimate favourite food. If you Is said it? to him, the last meal, it'd be lamb chop. Oh, yeah, wow. he loves it. Well, yeah, he really loves it. And cooked properly, yeah, nice. Really nice. Yeah, Nice cabbage, big pile of cabbage. And the thing <gasps> we sauce. bought was um, oh. carrots. We, we went for the expensive carrots. To be honest, I think carrots taste like nothing in the supermarkets normally. They just yeah. don't taste. Well, it's we not. Used to have it's not. It's not, it's not good. Uh, it's not the best time of the year for the carrots. I don't oh. blame the carrot. <laughs> okay. It's not the carrots' fault. It's been in a fridge and a, a cold chiller. So. Right. Um, people that have, um, lots of people that grow their own veg perhaps have a tunnel or. A, and some of them are pulling carrots at Christmas because I've got a friend, Kathy. Hello, Kathy, darling. Um, she, Christmas morning, goes out and pulls, obviously, if it's not too Is frosty. That when they but she's got a tunnel and she plants them in, obviously, I don't know, July time or whatever. And she's pulling those lovely little baby carrots at Christmas. Yeah. Wow. It's like, wow, Kathy. Mine would be frozen in the ground or <laughs> whatever. But yeah. Yeah, the carrots are. But I tell you what, I what what a revelation it is to roast a carrot. I've never roasted them. I've only been really boring. I think we actually did that, yeah. Yeah, um, really, really nice. You know those big horse carrots they sell? You think, flock of dogs, what's that? <laughs> but sort of put them in with a few potatoes. And I mean, I love roasted veg, but just put a few carrots in with your potatoes. Delish. Yeah. Delish. I haven't heard you say flog the dogs, actually, for a while. <laughs> no. That's quite a funny one, isn't it? Yeah. Just when you said it, I thought, oh, that, that old saying. Yeah. What does that mean? I haven't I mean, got a clue. Yeah, flog the dogs. It's just come from somewhere, somebody, something, somewhere said it. Or, yeah. And, or it's just come out of my bizarre, <laughs> wacky brain. Yeah. But, yeah. I wonder if it means something oh, really, drop really yeah. horrible now. Yeah. Probably oh, no, does, not. doesn't it? No, it doesn't. No? No. Did you doesn't like having a little bit of snow? It was lovely yes. for the children. A little break from all the doom and gloom and a little yeah. bit of snow. And, and you know what? It was just, yeah. um, it was like the day felt different. Yeah. Which was quite a good thing. I've when got, we're all cooped um, up indoors, it's quite nice to have some something unique to make you remember the day, you know. Yeah, it was lovely. Yeah. And it was lovely to to get a picture of your, your little, the front door of your house. Yeah. That was lovely. It That's was really snowing nice. like crazy. I know. It was really big. coming down. I actually got my work, the feeding done. I was so pleased because I fed everything because I've started feeding a few ewes and I've got a few lambs dotted about okay. and they all had their breakfast before the snow came. But um, well done them. And it's like, oh my goodness, they're real big flakes, aren't they? Yeah. Yeah, I could hardly. I went for a walk and it I just didn't covers wear a up hat. all the all the 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 muck and the yeah. sludge <laughs> and the yeah. mess. You think, oh look at it, it's so lovely white snow. Doesn't it look? Glorious. Yeah, uh, until you drive a tractor through it <laughs> and it goes all mushy <laughs> and brown again. And then it was nice because it yeah. sort of froze, didn't it? Uh, the frozen it that night and the next. So yeah, yeah, it was nice. Well, I didn't like the frozen pipes bit, but um, it was just oh, nice. Some I just pipes. thought it's lovely for the kids and and big kids as well. It was great. Yeah, yeah, it was really nice. There was quite a lot as well. So we don't we don't get a lot of snow really do no, we no and they're all about having we might have another little bit the weekend here we go this week coming it's going to be really mild isn't it i was quite frustrated that i couldn't film with the drone when it was snowing yeah but um there's an uh, there's an update on my drone which is that it's gone in for a a full mot and service because something might have happened to it <laughs> did you crash it Rue? you uh, haven't been in another tree have you could have happened perhaps could have happened if 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 anyone's looked closely enough, there was a there was a video at the end of one of the Good Mornings on the Farm where the, a pig 
uh, sort of crawls towards a camera. That's because my drone fell, fell <laughs> from the barbed wire fence and lodged in the muck. And then I had to run and save it from the pig, who, was, who looked like it was such a funny shot. I might have to put it at the end of this one so you can see, but the <laughs> it sort of dropped and I got a screen so I can see what's going on. And then I, as it dropped, I started looking at the screen and then I could just see this oh, no. sort of pig coming towards it. And I was thinking, is the pig going to have a little root around on my expensive piece of machinery but um no it was all good well it wasn't good but that was my phone not the pigs i love the reaction of barney when he met jack the oxford sandy and black ball oh i haven't seen it, it. well I d how how would i have seen that honestly we'll have to get a picture he is massive really he, the length of him and what oh, did he man, say that's so good or simeon say it was like something out of lord of the rings or <laughs> i don't know what and he's really funny. He's got these big sort of fluffy ears. You can't see his eyes. So he sort of cocks his little head up at you. He's so lovely. Pepper oh. and Gwen are like, God, get rid of him. He's eating all the ruddy food. <laughs> <laughs> so I have to put two troughs and I have to, you know. Oh, dear, it's That's quite funny. so funny. It really is funny. Oh, uh, we've got to come and see yeah, that. Yeah, he's lovely. He's absolutely lovely. So I got lovely. some, um, I was actually having a, having a think um, last yeah. night, which I should do, given, you know, we have Yeah, as, as we have our little chats in the morning. Um I was thinking about how what we're going to do this year. So I have, a, I have some. Um, I thought I might just say it on here as ideas. Yeah. And then everyone can tell me what they think. Yeah. But obviously, a, a big part is um, the, a big part of why you know um, why we're here is because we started doing those longer videos. Yeah, we which the are, videos. And I still, you know, every now and then watch one back or something. Someone plays one, and they really, I really enjoy them. So we want to do. I would like to do sort of four of those. And I, I was thinking what could be cool is to do spring, summer, yeah, autumn, yeah, winter. Yeah, yeah, we could do those, yeah. seasons. Awesome, yeah. Because we did the months, uh, which was harder. <laughs> but I was thinking we could do longer season-based ones. So talk about spring and summer and all the things that happen. Awesome. Um, that could be fun. And then I was also thinking just to because that's going to be a lot of work to maybe bring these down. So we do two of these every month. That's so it, every okay. second week. Um, so we'll mother's ramblings, won't you? Won't have to suffer. <laughs> 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 mother's ramblings, yeah. Unless there's, you know, yeah, there's something, there's something really yeah. um, exciting. And there's also another format that I'm excited to launch next week because we won't be doing this, which is my my Rufus's thoughts. Actually, I called it. What did I call it? Farm thoughts. Although that's likely to change. Which is my um, what I'm learning from the awesome. farm. So that's coming out next week. And then we'll do these every two weeks. But then I was thinking, yeah, to do four really n big, nice That'd be long nice, videos. won't it? So a little bit of lambing, a carving, yeah. a bit of field work. If we manage to get out in the fields, it's not Absolutely. too wet. So what I was wanna, thinking yeah. is we could just now brainstorm some of the things we could be doing in each of those months. Okay, yeah. Um, and then if anyone's got any suggestions or, or yeah, that, that, what they'd they like want to see, see yeah. Uh, that would be really cool so we can add maybe some of that in somewhere because we're plotting and scheming. We're plotting and scheming. <laughs> we do a lot of plotting and scheming. So yeah. spring, obviously lambing. Yeah. We've got the scanning coming up. Have we yeah, we've that? got the scanning in Still. Feb. Okay. We're going to do the ewe lambs. So you've got lambing, you've got, well, we're doing our calves. You might get here for a carving, but I very much doubt it. Perhaps. But um, carving, excuse me, a <coughs> uh, bit of field work, a bit of rut. Chain hour and, and rolling, mm -hmm. sitting there watching a the tractor go up and down. Lots of people like that. It's, yeah. Um, what does? How and does also, we want to plant some trees as well in the spring. I've right. got my first two oak trees. I know it's only two oak trees. It's pathetic, but small acorns they say, don't they? That's uh, we it. are going to plant some trees as well. We got some hedges to um, little bits of hedgy lay bits. If I get that far. Hedge laying. Yeah, a bit of hedge laying as well. We love a bit of hedge laying. Yeah, we've. We yeah. did some of the hedge, didn't we? So we keep cracking on and doing a little bit more. And yeah. if we do a little bit this year, and that then is we a do a tough job though, hedge laying. It is a tough job. It's very rewarding, but, it but you need some you strong up, like, yeah. men. Mm -hmm. Yeah, my some older brother men. is very good at that. Yeah, Mark is really, Shame really he's good. Not, <laughs> he's yeah. not very close. It'll be, it'll be uh, very imminent births when he'll be. Yeah. So don't think we'll be seeing Marcus, but. Um, <laughs> Yeah, hedge And how wonderful. will spring feel? I'm, uh, I mean, I, I can probably answer that, but 
in terms of how do you think about spring um spring this the it's very very it's the hardest work for me on the farm hard 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 for me it's the most exciting time yes it's it is lovely that's me looking in not doing it (laughs) yeah um well you know you've got your lambing and your carving and you're trying to pack in as much as you can in every day yeah so, but it's it is exciting because you've got the cold and the it's cold, and then the but the days are getting longer, mm-hmm. and then you get warm days, and the sun is getting warmer and warmer, yeah. and then you're lambing, and hopefully you're able to put your lambs out, and you're yeah. seeing them jumping and hopping, and and it's the start of you know a a beautiful summer, hopefully yeah. a yeah. beautiful. Yeah. Well, this year, I think for for us in us Brits at least, oh it's going to feel like um, wow, we can finally oh my it's light. We can go outside, yes. even if we are locked down. At least we can enjoy the outdoors. Again. We're going through the tough times at the we minute, are. people. Yeah. I mean, we're all feeling it. Even even farmers, and we're all worried, and we're all you know, it's and there's not a lot of fun to be had. Is I mean, I shouldn't be saying that, but you know, you want to see people. You can phone them and stuff but you want to hug or you want to yeah. oh let's just you know at the weekends when you let's just go no 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 so um you know it's tough times yeah. but i suppose it's cold so you sort of snuggle up in your little houses and your farms and yeah. you you know you light your fires or you you know but um and you just put the music on that you like and you sort of you know, cheer yourself up a bit. Yeah. But it is tough times, tough times, definitely. Yeah. But it's going to get better and better and better. Yeah. And we should be planning what we're going to be planting in our gardens and and planning, you know, what's what we're going to be doing next. Mm. Getting those seeds in, girls and boys. And, um, right, we might only have little gardens or big gardens, but what we're going to plant, what we're going to grow. And well, here's a, here's all a exciting your, thing. For, yeah, go on then. For, the gardeners out there, the green thumbs. Uh, we have a small garden. Yeah. We we wanted to maybe put put some climbers up because yeah. it would look nice, you know. Yeah. Establish our tu- our first touch on the house. Nice. Um, and then we we found ivy, and then people were like, don't. Put I don't no, no bamboo. <laughs> don't even think. Don't don't no uh, bamboo. No. Yeah. So ivy um, bamboo. If, if anyone's got Actually, any suggestions on nice. Um, decorative sort of border type plants that would be great I don't know why I've turned this into (laughs) (laughs) gardening live sorry yeah scrap that (laughs) don't worry about it next (laughs) okay and then summer yeah summer right we've got shearing in June yeah Um, you've got lots of jobs sheep jobs you know you're protecting them from the flies you are Mm. haymaking yeah you are silage making you are trying to locate straw um locate straw you are bolusing your cows and putting them outside which is the most exciting part so we'll all be flying the flags um <laughs> there's so much to do there's maintenance and stuff yeah. to do on sheds maintenance oh there's loads of stuff um yeah, doing yeah. wood getting wood in for the winter sawing wood you know all that sort of stuff yeah that's a good but one lots of animal husbandry stuff i would say yeah yeah when do we think the chickens will go back out? Oh, God, hopefully soon. <laughs> They're really fed up. Oh, yeah, um, bless them. I've got three now in the uh, incinera- the incineration plant. <laughs> oh, dear. <laughs> the segregation. Segregate. You know, they're in the... But, um, the egg p- pinches. Mm. And I lost one of my favourite little chickens this week. Yeah, so, um, you know, it's the old ones are sort of... That's and I've got a couple of the others who got the red style. It's like, oh, mum, I really can't stand this much longer. It's cold, it's miserable, and I want to go outside. And it's like, oh, God. So it's not very nice for chickens. Hopefully soon. I haven't yeah. really had a look at the update on chickens. I should do, but... Well, I actually have, because I... Um, oh, good. Not Fill us there in. is one. I oh, no. Think. Yeah, I, I was... Um, I was trying to do some research. <laughs> <laughs> I'm I know not got much it. of a researcher to be honest. I know I they just got sort of it. Say what we several lots in Ireland and mm. up north. Yeah. Eastern Amazingly, counties. because what I was actually looking for were clips. Um, so I just wanted to find. I haven't seen it in the news a lot, so I just wanted to find some information from yeah. a news site. Yeah. About it. There's not Zilch. many people have done anything Zilch. about it. It's sort of like 
let's just hide that let's one. Let's just hide that one. Mm hmm yeah. Or chickens. Yeah. <laughs> well, there are, yeah. Well, and when you don't hear anything, you do yeah. get a bit, oh, well, perhaps everything's fine and we'll be able to put them out or yeah. uh, we'll see. There's, there's, they're really, um, they're laying a few eggs now as well. So we've got... Well, that's good. Some of them have completely gone on strike. It's like you... <laughs> joking me you think i'm gonna but i've got a few <laughs> two couple of bunches couple of it's amazing so if given they're so unhappy and not really you know not wanting to live some of them and not wanting to lay eggs others <laughs> amazing how these sort of bigger um, battery farms or the farms where they don't how they get them to do anything but in these they're these modern um you still have the intensive you know the ones that don't go outside yeah but they um they're really well laid out now. It's not like it used to be. Oh my goodness! I can remember when I was a small child, battery hens. There would be about five in this very small cage, oh and wow. it was not very pleasant. But now it's not. As I think they have improved it so so much. Yeah, and also what the consumer's demanding, right? Which is oh a nice. God, yeah. That's the nice thought yeah. that oh everyone's sort of going. That's probably not the right way to. So and you know like the organic. You know, they've got to have so much room outside and, I mean, ours go everywhere, but I mean, <laughs> you know, the, I haven't got thousands. Yeah. But, you know, they're all, they've got a nice, nice Yeah, I've area. got some funny pictures of your chickens. It's just like <laughs> one in, one in about <laughs> 10 acre field. And <laughs> this is really free range, but, this um, one. You know, I want to improve my pastures. Yeah, yeah. So I'm going to be, di we're going to be learning and doing some of that as well, hopefully over the next coming months in the, the spring and the summer, definitely. Yeah, it'd be very interesting. I mean, I think it's best that you, I'm not going to have time to do it, in, but we might be doing some autumn sowing. So that'd be interesting as well. But we've got all sorts of things going on. There's wire worms and things that are eating things and doing things. But um, we want to as well, hopefully over the next couple of months, we're going to be doing ditch out as well. So and perhaps doing, pulling some mole plows through to do, burn, doing a bit of drainage and stuff. So right. there's lots of things I want to do. But all these things cost money. Right? They do, yes. So we just toodle along, but the the grass we have and the pasture we have, we want to conserve and just improve it, hopefully. Yeah, I mean, I'd love to be, um, love to try and help this year on, on those points, so that'd be cool. But, you know, me and tractor, dr the thought of sitting on a tractor. I, I found, I actually found some cool tractors, some electric, <laughs> some electric, I found an article on electric loaders. Ooh. I was going to print them off actually, I didn't do it in time, but um, maybe next I'll week. I'll tell you what I would love. There's I'll like five electric loaders, I was like, I was going to, I wanted to see what you thought. Of do you know what I love though? Can you remember those little bobcats? Yeah, I love those bobcats oh as well. God, the fun I'd have in one of them. Yeah. <laughs> oh my God, Sarah Den on a bobcat, look out. <laughs> Honestly, yeah, I I've love seen those. Them, they're all levers. They're levers on both sides, aren't and they? And they went so quick, didn't yeah. they? Just Can flying in and out. you remember Shawnee doing yeah, it? Yeah, I do. Wowza. Yeah, it was amazing. Yeah, I like that. And he got like three of them on a lorry and then um, got went yeah. again. Oh, it was so cool. So, um, definitely. And the, and the way you used to clean out, it's like, what? Yeah. That was so fast. So what do you reckon to autumn then? Could we see oh, maybe autumn. a market in autumn? Do you think? Oh, yeah, we could go to market. That'd be really Definitely. interesting, wouldn't yeah, it? Yeah, really interesting. Especially for people who aren't in the country oh God, to yeah. see a British and, market. And I'd love yeah, to see and a, a lot of an these Aus markets Aussie. where I go. Um, oh. I go to one, one of the markets. There's a gallery as well where you can go and watch. We'll so have how to, fantastic yeah, is that? Yeah, we'll have to get them maybe the name and ask if we can go and see. Because that would be really interesting. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, it'd be good to Especially see. Especially because then it would um, be it would spring, and then by autumn, right? That's when you'd be selling some lambs, or a oh bit my later. goodness, yeah. Okay, we'd be getting lambs ready, be grading okay. them, you know, and um, so that would be going on in, in the summer as well. Yeah. So that would be summer and autumn. Um, getting perhaps we might have some Christmas fat slot shows. <gasps> uh oh. Yeah. That'd be a winter a one. Yeah, that'd be winter one. Um. Yeah, I just quite like the idea of the season thing because farms are very seasonal. They are. Um, yours probably less so than, well, actually, every farm's seasonal, isn't it? I was thinking arable and stuff. There's there's actual rules for it, isn't there? But Oh, there's loads of stuff. I, um, like on this place, by the autumn, I want to put, put up a polytunnel and do things. So 
watch this space. Are you going to commit space? to that on on this? Oh, I hope so, Ruth. <laughs> I really hope so. It's not going to be a massive one, yeah. but we're going to have a polytunnel, definitely. Nice. And we would do... And your goats. Oh, so you've got your polytunnel, <laughs> your goats. <laughs> Steady <yeah>. on. <laughs> Steady on, you'll give me the bile. But... Um, <laughs> No, we just, I mean, and then it'd be good for people to say, you know, what you, they'd like to see as well. Yeah, it would be. I mean, I'm sitting here and I'm, I'm going to go up the yard and I'm going to carry on my day. It's like, oh my goodness, I should have said that. I'm going <laughs> to do this. And da, 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 da. Well, that's great. Well, now you know maybe what an idea I mean, perhaps year. we ought to have a, a whiteboard so we could just sort of, oh, oh yeah, goodness. we could do this. Perhaps an not. Diary. <laughs> diary do That sounds diary a bit too advanced for us. Anyhow, I yes. am so busy at the minute. We had such a busy week, sheep wise. We bolus the ewes, bolus this, bolus that, and I couldn't find me blooming trimmers. So we've got a load of um, clipping out, oh, and we've got to great. be thinking about doing the heptavax. So it's been a very sheepy week. Very sheepy week. week. I actually didn't. We're, we're out of time now. Oh no, are we? Yeah. Sorry. Um, that's okay. Um, well, maybe one sec. Let me just. What are you doing? In? Oh, Please forgive that short uh, <laughs> pause in proceedings. Please continue. Yeah, well, I'm just saying we've had a very busy week with the sheep this week. We've been yeah. doing lots of bowling. Mm. Uh, we had to get the rams in because they were very cold, wet, and miserable. But um, we've bolused all the ewes, so yeah. they've had 24 7 7 boluses. Um, done the thaves, they've all had a bolus. Okay. And now we've got to be thinking next week about doing the heptavac and trimming them out. Busy week. And that does uh, sound more very sheep busy. work today because I've got the ewe lambs that we're going to, and they're all going to have a bolus. So it's like a multivitamin. It's got iodine and, and that's selenium. And for, uh, for the lambs. Yeah, and, and for the ewes as well, just to give them extra oomph because we're short of iodine. So I've done all the young cattle. I usually just do the cows, don't, you, don't we? But yeah. I've actually done the young cattle and I thought this is ridiculous. So um, um, we do all the sheep now with the bones. Yeah. I wonder what difference you'll notice yeah. with that. I've noticed a difference in the cattle as well. Yeah. I've done, I done the boys, you know, those big lads. Oh my God, they're like giants. <laughs> They really are. How funny. So yeah. they may be processed. Well, yeah, they're so just they probably, healthier They're animals. all of it. Yeah. I mean, it's going to affect everything. But yeah. why does I get... Uh, this is what I should be looking at. Why does it get locked in the soil? What happens to it? Is it because of all the rain? Is it because... Why are we getting all the... And lots of other people now are, you know, suffering and... Could you do a bit of arable here on the land? Um... Yeah, we Not could. this year because no, we don't want to. I just want. I, do you know what? I just want to improve my grassland as much as possible. Right. That's what I want to focus on. But people have said you ought to put one of your your grass fields down and grow some corn. Because I mean, if I you because then you could use that for the bedding. Yeah, then you got a little bit of straw, but I haven't got any of it the machines through. I okay. could borrow a plow and I can sit and plow and I can sit and go up and down with a pair of discs and stuff. Yeah. But, um, oh, really? <laughs> Who's going to combine it? Oh, my God, me flipping gateways. I'll never get one of them combines through. No, you wouldn't. <laughs> I'd like to see one, though. <laughs> we ought to try and film one. <laughs> combines are cool. Yeah. Also, you've got to get one to your style, you know, maybe about 40 years old. Oh, yeah. Yeah, there's a few of them around here. <laughs> Good. <laughs> I'm, there's one I'm... Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, well, we've got to see that. Yeah. You'll have to put but me in I mean, touch. yeah, it's probably, possibly an option, definitely, to put a field down to grow some... Um, grow well, that's what I quite like about uh, farming on the on sort of, like, when you look at it from the outside, is the way to grow it is quite simple, you know, it's just to try and get more <laughs> land, because once you get more and more and more, then the cost of everything goes down, doesn't it? But then your workload goes up, obviously. Well, the, the thing I would like to, and that is to, you know, if I was going to do like a, an arable crop, I would like to do some roots as well. I do stubble turnips, you know, so you've got something for your sheep and your lambs to fatten on and stuff. And yeah. Do different, that sort of stuff really does interest me. But I've got to, grassland is the key theme this year. Cool. My grassland has got to be so much better. So much better. I've got to make so it So when better. you said you got soil samples, do you do we know what they are? Or how do we... Yeah, I've got a sheet of paper with it all on. Really? 
And then I've put the lime on, which I'm really pleased with. And um, I've got to put some more on. Well, I put uh, quite a lot of lime on. Yeah. So that should be... So I don't know if you have it... That went on in the autumn. Right. So, um, yeah, we'll see. Because someone said, so don't start doing all this stuff until you do get your soil and so you know what you're up against before you start sort of thing. Yeah. You know, and I know I needed lime. And then um, we've got to put some on at Round Hill as well. Yeah, yeah. To sweeten the grass up. I... It's got to be done. I've been putting muck on. I put organic matter on every year and you know we arrow it in and stuff and i haven't put any lime on i can't remember the last time wow because it's always one of those things in the autumn and then the autumn's the worst time because well i've never got enough money to pay for the flipping yeah. lime so it's like <laughs> i'm really sorry i'm not going to mess you about it. it's a no-go <laughs> it's a no-go i'd yeah. like to i would yeah. love to but i can't yeah so that's it well, there we go makes sense all right then thanks mum uh, we Quite didn't actually go to winter, but mate, you know we'll, we'll do one of yeah, these. Yeah, don't worry, we'll do that next week. It, and if you've got and any I, ideas, I, and, and, and I'm glad you haven't asked about the costings. You uh, know, that was what I was going to yeah, say. Yeah, I was going to say I, I've kept qu very quiet about it because I haven't <laughs> done my own work, boys and girls. I've been so knackered this week. It's been so busy. It's like, oh god, I hope you don't start talking about co you know how many we'll people let, will I we'll feed off this farm. But we are going to do it. Yeah, it is a good thing to do, and we will do it. You yeah, know, well, I would love I think to know be interesting. how many people. So I was thinking this about my chickens. I thought, oh my god, the eggs. No, we won't go with the eggs and the chickens. <laughs> no, we won't start with that. We'll just do the. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Well, maybe we can sit yeah. down together at some point yeah. and work it out. And Anyhow, look, it it's getting light. I can hear the traffic. It's getting busy out there. Yeah. But um, any I closing hope, messages? Yeah, I just hope everybody's doing good. Yeah. It's tough, but we can do this. Yeah, we can do is. this, and we're going to do this. And, uh, yeah, just go day by day. And my love goes out to you all and everybody take care. Yeah, thanks, Mum. All right, then. See Bye -bye. you soon. Bye.